Good morning. How is everybody? Okay, you know, I I made a resolution in the past over the weekend that I'm just going to dive two feet into some new things. Um, Instagram kind of being one of them and um, trying to, you know, create a new groups and whatever. I've had this VIP group hidden for a long time. I hadn't figured out how to use it. Um, so I just figured I'd dive right in this morning. Of course, it leaves a little bit of, uh, you should learn a little bit more how it works before you do it. Um, so I've been rushing around trying to um, get this group up. So um, I, r rumor has it, why, why did I create a group? Rumor has it that Facebook um, will push um, group notifications faster than they will from a page. So I thought, what a better time to try than with the pre-order so that um, one, it kind of keeps the, it, I know people spoil it, they don't want to know. And that's great, I get that, totally respect it. Um, but other people do, and so maybe this will keep it from people who don't want to see it, but I don't know, we're gonna try. Welcome, this is my pre-pre-order um, reveal. Tammy has gone off on vacation. This is something we usually do together. So it's me, me, and me. Um, and this, I will tell you, so this was a very exciting on stage and I couldn't say anything <laughs> until it went live, but Stampin' Up! asked me to uh, design some products, or not design products, design projects from new products. Um, and I couldn't say anything. I had, we had to change the scoop schedule because I'm like, I can't leave my craft room until I do this. So I have some stuff that no one else has. Um, and I absolutely love this set. So I was gonna give it a minute to let people come on. I realized I hadn't changed the um, requirements for the uh, group that, that you had to request and I had to approve, I had to get rid of that. So um, just letting people go, please share. Please let people know um, that this is out there and um, that I, this is what I'm doing. So exciting. I don't know what I'm gonna put in this group compared to the page, but we're gonna, we're gonna try. So here we go. We have, let's come down here. I gotta try to change things on the fly. We have an all new upcoming mini catalog and celebration brochure. If you're not a demonstrator, this is our spring into summer offering catalog, mini catalog. And the celebration is, is it, it's, it's an event and it's kind of the, it, it's the best part. Every time you spend $50 out of any catalog, you get to pick something free out of this catalog. I can't show you what's in these catalogs yet, but I can show you the stuff I have, which is all kind of behind me here. Um, and this is the time that everyone loves being a demonstrator because we get the new catalog first, we get to order from it first. If you went to on stage, you got a small limited amount to buy. Um, and then all demonstrators will get to purchase from um, both these. You get to purchase from this, you get to earn from this, um, and that will happen in December. So, woohoo! Um, so without too much further ado, Let's get on to the spoiling, <laughs> the spoiler spoiling of what we have. Okay, so I'm gonna start first. I'm gonna, I'm leaving my, I, I consider that the sweet mine now. I'm leaving that one for last. So let's start with, okay. Whoop, I can't show you the, my, my notes. This is the fine art, so I want to be careful. The fine arts, floral premiere collection. So this starts with the art gallery stamp set. I will tell you the colors on this um, in the, um, what people are, were demonstrating, Shelly and Sarah demonstrated this one. It is yummy and it's the one on the cover. So it is this, look, look, look. And, and you see this, we couldn't order this yet. This is, gold foil, you know, like, oh, and this is all I can show you is the front cover, but look at the goodness in there. So here, this is the stamp set art gallery. It has a bundle. This is floral gallery dies out. So this says just, hold on, oh, the tape that they used on these dies 
your projects would never you know come apart if we use that it says just want to say um, so just want to say sorry just want to say happy birthday so here's a big die I love big dies of words um, we got the flowers you can cut out some really cool like postage stamp style labels yep so that's that then we got a ribbon let me open this up I tried to get all the stuff open in advance all right, and this is fine art ribbon. Does it say anything more? Fine art ribbon. Nope, just 10 yards, three quarters inch. It's got like a, a gold. It feels like cutting linen-y um, or with a gold. That's the ribbon. Then we have the painted texture 3D embossing folder. So it looks like, you know, paint on a canvas, all that smush stuff. Um, so really cool. So that's, this is all in the seat. Then we have the paper. Oh, isn't that pretty? All right, where'd my, where'd my open the paper tool go? I'm gonna just move these all aside. And let's open the paper. Let's see, so the colors here, do I have colors? No, I do not have colors, colors here. All right, we have Bumblebee, Flirty Flamingo, Mary Merlot, Mossy Meadow, Night of Navy, Old Olive, Petal Pink, Pool Party, Poppy Parade, Pumpkin Pie, So Saffron, Terra Terracotta Pile, and Whisper White. So here we go. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Let me back it out just a smidge. I want to make sure you can see all of this goodness. Oh my God, look at these. I will tell you, the catalogs, as gorgeous as they are, never do them justice. You can't, I just, you just can't. They're so pretty. So, ooh, look at, and you can see, you can see like the, the paint. So these gotta be photo realistic. That's like, you can see the smear of the paint palette on the, um, on the canvas. Oh my God. Oh, gorgeous like Monet and just any sort of walk through an art gallery. Woo! All right, that's going top of the list. I will be doing a product share. Um, I'm going to try to get that info up sooner than later. Um, so you can get a little bit of all these papers and the embellishments and the ribbon. This is the Golden Garden Designer Acetate. This is right. Yes. Okay, hold on. So acetate's always fun to play with. Oh, come on. There we go. Woo! All right. Here we go. All right. See if I can... You see that? There we go. Uh, over black cardstock so it's clear acetate with the gold you know so that's what it looks like it does have a film on it so make sure you take the film off when you go to create but there it is so you can see the detail with the black all right let's see and there's then there's this one okay oh isn't that pretty <gasps> yummies and then one more um, design. Oh, yummy, yummy, yummy. So that is, let me read it again. That is Golden Garden Designer Specialty Acetate. And these are all in the Fine Art Premier Collection Suite. All right. So next, we're going to do... This is our for our masculines. Um, let me pull you back in for a smidge. All right, this is well suited. So for the men in our lives, handsomely suited. We got some ties, some great male birthday, Father's Day stamps, and we have a matching die set. And this is suit and tie dies and look at this so 
this creates, you know how we always like to, you know, we make the shirt cards. Oh, so here is like your, your, your collar, your, your lapels, and then you can cut the V you can, so you can cut the shirt out, you know, the, the V out of the, for the jacket and do the shirt underneath. And then you can do the lapels from the jacket and then you get the tie, the bow ties, the little collar, your shirt collar. And here's that you can make it a pocket, you know, your pocket square for your shirt, or it's a cute little banner. There's even little buttons, button, button. Who's got the button? Um, I saw there's a band if you want to make a belt or other things. And here's the corner of the tie. So this goes over here for the tie. So cute. So, so cute. I'm going to put, put, oh boy, I'm going to, I'm going to have these things all lost before before it's over all right so this is the that's the bundle then i'll get the third so this is well suited twine combo well suited twine combo looks like basic gray and knight of navy twine and it's a little bit thinner than some of our our twines somewhere between t the thick twine and thread um i'm gonna get one that come off you know so that's kind of cool and then, oops, sorry, I'm just going to pull this apart. Tape sticking to me. Put these back in the bin. So I don't All right, and here is, this is well-suited DSP, basic black, basic gray, Cajun craze, Night of Navy, Pacific Point, Poppy Parade, and Smoky Slate. So let's dig into this. The old snip. Mm. It's a fresh pack. It's a fresh pack of paper. All right, and all right. So here we go. Oh, I've got to love a plaid and a stripe, and like a tweed, like a suit tweed. Uh, basic check, like that could be your shirt. There we go. Kind of grays, different grays, with a floral, like a, that would be the fun tie, or pocket square, um, gray pinstripe, gotta love a man in some pinstripe, and, oh my god, these are so, oh, a paisley, I didn't see this in the catalog, love a paisley, oh, that's so cool. All right, so that is the well-suited suite. All right, so one, two, three. All right. Next up, this is the Dandy Garden. This is a mega suite. This is suite is as big as the suite I got to um, show off. That was one of my questions when I was doing it. I'm like, do I have the biggest suite? And he's like, well, there's another one, but it's not not fully being demoed the way mine was. Um, so, all right, so the Dandy Garden Suite, I'm going to make pieces here. All right, is, so it's a mega suite, so it has more than one uh, stamp set bundle. So first we have the Dragonfly Garden, which you may have seen out already because uh, we got to order this early um, to use to make a uh, card. So on, on stage or any sort of stamping event, there's always a make and take um, where we go and we stamp and we make stuff, and we get to take it with us. Well, you can't really do that at home. So they basically said, here, buy all these, this list of products that you can buy early and cut all this paper and this is what you can make. I did not do that. I will tell you, I rarely stamp at live events. Um, I, I'm too busy chatting or too busy whatever. I can't, don't follow along my you know, OCD, I'm every which way. Um, I do it later. So I haven't done it yet because I've, I've been so busy um, since and then needed to take a, a nap. <laughs> <laughs> so this uh, is a bundle with the um, let's find the right name, Dragonfly Punch. It's kind of basic. Um, so you get the big dragonfly and the little dragonfly, and they match up. So that is part one of the Dandy Garden Suite. So that is the Garden Wishes bundle. Then we have no Dragonfly Garden bundle. This is the Garden Wishes. So we got some. Oh, what I don't want. Dandelions, which I never want growing in my yard, but they are kind of pretty. 
You know, like every kid's dream, you know, to blow the dandelions around. Every homeowner's like, not in my lawn. Oh. And then some really cool dyes. Look at this one. That go with it. Okay, so this is the Garden Wishes Bundle. Again, part of the Dandy Garden Suite. All right, we're going to stick this aside. Then we have okay, the paper. This is... Let's see if I can show this off. So these are six by six. Six by six. This is basic black. Uh, Black Ray Bliss, Bumblebee, Calypso Coral, Misty Moonlight, Mossy Meadow, and Whisper White. Um, so these are, so there would be, oh, flip over. Um, when they're six by six, there's 48 in the pack, 12 different design, 12 different double-sided designs, you get four of each. And these are all just yummy 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 I will tell you this catalog is yummy I have every I, every time Stampin' Up! does a new catalog they seem to better their better their best um, every time so that is the paper the rest of them are just the same sheets repeated and then we have okay this is a braided linen trim so if you've had our other um, braided linen trims, it's the same one, but this is in Mossy Meadow. It's nice. And then these bad boys. These are ladybugs. Are these not the cutest? So a little glue dot or adhesive tape you know, the, the, will work. I have not put them down yet, so we'll play with those on a future Coffee and Crafts. Oops. And then, because there's more, we have, let's see, let me open this one. This is Dandy Laser Cut Paper. Oh, there it is. Like, I have lost my paper opener. Da -da -da. There we go. All right. All right. So this is laser cut paper. Here, let me you out so you can see the whole thing zoom in zoom out zoom in zoom out okay so here we have um so we got some butterflies we got some labels we got a large square some leaves uh, we got some circles with some uh, detail on the side and then try to do this without Getting things all mixed up. Okay, so then these are ones you can cut out the individuals or you cut out the square and lay it on the top. Um, and then you get some individual ones. And so these are the same on both sides. So they're white, not whisper white, but it's white. Um, these are the laser, dandy laser cut paper. Then, and there's more. Because it, like I said, it's a mega bundle. We have the Dandy Gardens Memory and More card pack. So, don't you love the Memories and More? It's you want to make a quick card. This is where it is. Um, so yes, scrapbooking, um, photo journaling, um, quick card making. This I just saw this up. Make a cute little um, recipe card if you want to share a recipe with someone. Wouldn't that be adorable? Maybe something with honey in it. Um, so just kind of real quick, you know, matches, um, took me obviously the wrong way. Uh, the whole dandy garden paper and sweet today was amazing. So, and they're double sided, you know, so these are multiple, multiple uses as well as over here. Um, there's a cardboard so I can, like I said, wouldn't that make a great recipe card? Like honey dipped, um, a scone or something, you know, like that. That's perfect. So I can see when I look at that. Oh, and here's some die cuts and toots. So then with these memories and more, you get, you well, additionally, we have envelopes that put together. You want to make a super quick, here we go. 
super quick greeting card. There we go. So you got the envelopes that already have the images. So super quick. We got the flap inside done. Super quick, super awesome. And here are the cards. So they only made one size, but the great thing is that's all you need because you can just put the little one down and um, you know, and then you can add a greeting and you're done. Super simple. So this is the Dandy Gardens. These are the memory and more card kit pack. Oh, I don't care. That's all I got. You, 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 you. All right, that was the Dandy Garden Suite. Okay. Here are some bundles. So first bundle, this is many messages. It's got some really great sayings. Um, red rubber, but there's a fun, fun element to this. We're going to match that with the messages die. Die. Singular. Let me get it off the backing. Oh, here we go. So here is the die. It's one die and this is so great. So you stamp this, stick them in your stamp apparatus, do a bunch of different colors. Oh, hold on. Hold on. All right, there we go. And then you can punch them all out or die, die cut them all out at once. And then you can have a little stack of all your pre-cut, pre-stamped greetings all in one. Woohoo! So I rarely keep my dies with my stamp sets because I use my dies for everything, all these different shapes. This one might stay in this uh, in this folder. But look at all the sh cool shapes. Even if you weren't going to um, keep them together, use them for other things. You got, you know, little postage, all these different shapes. These are cool. This is a good one. All these different greetings. So this is the many messages bundle. Then I have, oh God, this is gorgeous. All right. We have Simply Succulent. Isn't that pretty? All right. So for, and so again, big, big sets of dies. So here is um, the dies that go with it. This is one sheet of the dies. You got some nice labels, um, ones that will cut out the flowers and the pot. Um, some additional images. I guess this is a um, aloe vera plant um, and some different plants. But this one isn't this stunning so this is a die and it'll cut out all these shapes so you get all this delicate shape so you can have that background so you don't like those laser cut ones that are so pretty but you got to buy one every time you want to make something here's kind of a similar idea with the succulent theme and you can just cut more and more and more and more of them so this one is really cool so this goes together with the simply succulent all right hold on getting stuff all mixed up hold on let me just go go over so that's a simply succulent. Now we have floating and fluttering because we always need more butterflies. I love butterflies. And then with that for the bundle is the fluttering dies. So you get a nice um, accent uh, rectangle and then you get a matching um, rectangle labeled die. And the butterflies cut out all the individual butterflies bunch of separate ones, um, really pretty. And then you can stamp the inside of the butterflies. So you want to color them, different colors, super easy. Fluttering, floating and fluttering. All right, move this group back over here. All right. All right, so kits, 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 kits. Who loves kits? I do, because it's quick, it's easy, and you can make up a whole bunch, lots of fun. So this is, we start with the stamp set, the You Are Amazing, happy birthdays, whatever, and we have the You Are Amazing Project Kit. So we're gonna, I'm not going to open the whole thing up, because this, this is a stamp and scoop in a box. Um, but here is what the project kit creates. Um, so we can quick create birthdays, congratulations, 
anything sort of, um, and there's some other amazing kits in this catalog as well, but this will definitely be on the up and coming stamp and scoop episode. Like I said, it's stamp and scoop in a box, but we all love kits. Okay. This, this is it. This was the ultimate. This was there. So they sent me the four pages of my catalog of my project, my uh, suite, so I could help making my projects. And in the picture was one of these, and I didn't get it. These are blending brushes. So I knew about this <laughs> since mid September, and I couldn't say anything. Let's open these up. These are these. They look pretty, and from what I'm told. Again, they, um, ooh. I know this started in the makeup industry that people were using them to blend makeup and then us crafters went, yeah, give me that. Um, and they started using them. So Stampin' Up! has come up with their own. It is so soft. <laughs> it is a fine brush. It's not a, um, a sponge. It's, it's fine bristles. If you can see, there you go. And so basically you rub it in your, your ink and then you'll rub it onto your paper. So I can't wait to um, play with these. The OCD in me, I have a feeling I'm gonna be owning 50 of these. <laughs> Cause I, but I'm told they wash beautifully. And so I probably just have a pink, a blue, a purple, but I feel like I'm gonna have one for each color cause that's who I am. Embrace your crazy as someone once told me recently <laughs> okay so if you are new to Stampin' Up we do celebrations <laughs> we do celebration right this year's celebration is two months January and February and during celebration when you purchase $50 worth of product any other product in any other catalog you earn a product from celebration and so we got to get some early so let me show you what we got coming up all right so let's start with this we have approaching perfection um the bad news is i forgot your birthday the good news is i forgot your age uh so what if you're older you're fabulous um if things really do get better with age then you are approaching perfection uh newsflash Birthdays found to be good for health. Studies show that people who have more birthdays live the longest. So here's a fun one. Um, here's another one. This one's going to work great with the Stamparatus. It's the corner bouquet. Um, then it'll allow you to kind of put them maybe on two opposite corners or all four corners or whatever. Um, really, really pretty. I'm saving one for last here. Hold on. We have Heal Your Heart. Uh, we're in this together. I can't promise to always fix your problems, but I can always promise you won't face them alone. Uh, sorry for your loss. Don't know what I would do without you. Wishing I could heal your heart and thank you. I love a good font and script. All right. The rumor is Tammy made a boo-boo and ordered nine of these. Who wouldn't want nine donkeys? <laughs> Darling donkeys. So we got the goats. We had pigs before. We had crazy chickens. We have more chickens. They didn't, didn't let us order the chicken. But now we have darling donkeys. And these are goats with a $50 purchase. Um, so we got Hee Haw, You're the Best. Who remembers Hee Haw? I, can I date myself? To the, there was a TV show, Hee Haw. Hee Haw! Um, and you get the fun donkeys. So they're going to be fun to color. There's also two Design Series papers. This is the first one. Um, this one is Oh So Ombre. Ombre! Okay. And let's get this out. So again, 48 sheets, 12 different um, ones, 12 different double-sided. So we have, oh, colors. Hold on. The colors are Bermuda Bay, Blackberry Bliss, Granny Apple Green, Rococo Rose, and Whisper White. So... So this is this one style. So one, two, three, four. So you get four of each. Or is it three of each? Oh, I'll have to look. Looks like three of each. So one, two, 
three. That's going to screw up my product share, but okay. Oh, no, there's more. So I'll go through and see. Where's this page? Oh, so 48 sheets, 12 each of double-sided designs in four colors. All right. So I just saved. Maybe I got a batch. I'll have to go count. But so here is, so it's one, two, three. So one, two, three, four. And then there we go. This is the back side. Let's say the back side. Disney World fans, back side of water. Um, so those are cool. I like these a lot. These will be um, a great background. And one more, one more DSP. This is Flowers in Field Designer Series Paper, Bumblebee, Cherry Cobbler, Flirty Flamingo, Granny Apple Green, Just Jade, Misty Moonlight, Petal Pink, Pool Party, Poppy Parade, Pumpkin Pie, Shaded Spruce, So Saffron, and Whisper White. Okay. Come on. Here we go. And. So, these are super pretty. These are pretty. I can see these getting used in a lot of different projects. So again, this is free when you purchase $50 worth of catalog product. So yummy, yummy, yummy. All right. I think that leaves our last one. Did I get everything else? All right, hold on. Hold that thought. You, 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 you. Okay. Let me introduce you to the Always Love You Suite. So this is a mega bundle. I'm gonna show you my my things I made for my for my presentation. So I had 17 minutes and all this product to display. <laughs> and so and they I'm give not you sure a I understand. All right, sorry, doesn't understand. And um, 17 minutes, all this product, and they give you this list of features and benefits that you have to talk about. I'm like, I'm not going to get it all in. So this is <laughs> how I managed to do it. So these are, so this is the Always In My Heart bundle. The bundle consists of a stamp set and dies. And you can see you guys, you guys have been around with me for a while. You know how I display um, dies and whatever. So you can see some are um, coordinate with the dies for stamping. And then the stamps, the dies work together to create additional images. This beautiful floral heart also matches up with these dies and you can add on to your floral. And this really fun banner has been coordinated to work with the heart. Bundle number two. This is the forever and always bundle. Come on. All right, so these are the Forever and Always bundles. It's line art images that you can color, um, and the dyes match up with some of the greetings. And we also have very similar to one in the holiday catalog. We got Always in Love. Uh, it's got a background die and a detail die that can be layered together to create um, a third image. I would show you the love one, but it, it has gotten knocked off somewhere in this craft room. Um, but they also match up with the... Um, the stamped images. Because this is a photopolymer stamp set, you can manipulate your stamps and it will also work on the banner from the last uh, bundle. It also includes the True Love DSP. This is black and white. And up to this point, yeah, black and white, and you can color it, whatever, blah, blah, blah. I have I spent more time coloring. I think I've used up almost all of this paper. I absolutely loved it. So it's one side is floral. The reverse is um, a graphic, so good for masculine or feminine, because we're always looking for something to do um, 
with mats, even though we got that well suited, um, it's, um, uh, you, you always want more options when you do a masculine, whatever. These, they are 12 by 12 sheets. Before I started working, I cut six by sixes and put them aside so I could continue to show it off a little bit better. Um, they are full size. This is all I have left. Um, so that you can see the fun floral patterns. They are fun to cut out and fussy cut. They are very detailed. And I would say normally this would not be something I would be attracted to. I colored each of these different flowers with a different watercolor pencil. I'm not going to show you all my, my samples yet. I make it come back. Um, same with this one. A lot of little daisies and what have you. More great flowers. And then this one. Oh, I wasn't showing you the backsides. The backside of water. I'm a Disney fan. If you can't tell. If you haven't if you haven't got to know me yet, that's what other than stamping. Disney is my thing. Alright, so that's the that's one paper. Cause a mega bundle is not one paper. <laughs> it's multiple papers. So in addition, we have foils in Sahara Sand, Blushing Bride, and Rococo Rose. But it doesn't stop there. We have this designer series paper. This is Sahara Sand, Metallic Sahara Sand on Sahara Sand, Metallic Blushing Bride on Blushing Bride, and Metallic Rococo Rose on Rococo Rose. Like, totally cool. Totally cool. Then, okay. These rock. Rock the Casbah, kids. This is matte black dots. Expect to see these on almost everything I create going forward. I love, like, enamel shapes and whatever. These are awesome. Matte black dots, two sizes. You get... 200 and something. I don't remember the, the number. And then we have, this is Blushing Bride 3 8 Metallic Ribbon. I don't even have to look anymore at some of these um, descriptions. I don't know what the metallic is. That was my question for Stampin' Up! And they didn't get back to me. Whether it's a gold or a copper or a bronze or a champagne. It's metallic. I don't know. It's It's got a definite like, goldish hue, but I don't know if they're technically calling it gold. It doesn't say in the catalog. It just says... Blushing Bride Metallic. Um, so I think they're just trying to go with the Blushing Bride itself as metallic, but there's a there's a there's a metal in there. And then these are heart charms. I just got them all willy nilly. They are flat on one side, and they're slightly rounded on the other. And you can um, I was in the adhesive sheets we have. To attach them, I was literally sticking them on the adhesive sheet and then pulling them up. And I'd use my little take a pick tool to kind of get rid of the cobweb to stick them down. Or you can tie them on with like a, a twine or whatever. Super duper cute. And then I didn't have any. Uh, give me a second. Matchbox style box. This one's decorated. Um, these super easy to put together. Like to the point where I could, I was able to do it without looking, um, and they don't require any adhesive to put these together. Super duper cute. I'll show you a couple little things. Here's, I'll give you, I'll give you a few samples that I made with the the suite. So this one I try to, especially very Valentine's love, um, anniversary theme suite, but I like to say, look around and be like, how, how can I make it not what it's designed for so that you can see the value in your products that you're buying? So I colored it. I was feeling very fall and the fall colors of some uh, flowers. So I colored it with the um, blends and then I used the greeting, best kind of friend is a kind like you. And I used non valentine's love colors um and this is my basic beginner card just use i i love large greetings i love beautiful font this was my ultimate i think 
stamping up. I must have heard me say it a million times. Um, so I just stamped the always in the Rococo Rose, added the forever in the memento, and then multiply stamped, repetitively stamped the always over and over again in Blushing Bride. Super simple, super fun, easy. And then here's one more. These will all end up on my um, uh, blog soon. Just using that, the sunning dye, the paper, the ribbon, the matte black dots. So this, all of this is going to be available to demonstrators to pre-order December, I think, 4th. Um, if you join my team right now, you will get the opportunity to put it um, to pre-order. If you decide to join my team in December, you can add it to your starter kit, um, which means you get $125 worth of product for $99. Bucks. Um, if you are a customer, you can wait until January 4th. I hate it when they don't do things on the 1st. So then I have to actually remember all these little dates. Um, I think it's January 4th. The holiday catalog or no, it's the, the holiday catalog retires and the January, June mini catalog um, becomes live. And I think that's it. There'll be a product share. Look for that in um, a couple days. And I think that's it. I'm so glad you guys all join me. Please share um, this uh, video so that uh, word gets out about my new group. And I think that's it for today. So I thank everybody. And I guess that's how I'm just going to end it. Bye, all. <laughs>